Hi, my name is Sabna Rosnick, and this is the channel where I do mini readings of poetry, so, sometimes, most times my own work, sometimes uh, the work of others. Today I'm going to read a poem, Rivers, by Miyosh. That's the book. Um, selected poems, 1931 to 2004. Miyosh, as you probably know, was a Nobel Prize winner for literature in 1980, I think very well-known Polish, Polish poet um, who lived, he was born in 1911 and he experienced the Holocaust and he wrote about that a lot, but also about a lot of other things that he experienced. He had a special affinity for rivers, which spoke to me because as you know, um, as you probably know, my hometown, Elkhorn City, is the gateway to the Breaks Interstate Park, the Grand Canyon of the South. And our pride and joy is the Russell Fork River, which is considered by some as unrunnable when it comes to whitewater rafting, although plenty do. Uh, class 5, Class 6 rapids. And so, beautiful river, beautiful river. Always changing, which also makes it um, more of a challenge and anyway it's our pride and joy and so i wanted to read this poem called rivers of Meyoshis. under various names i have praised only you rivers you are milk and honey and love and death and dance from a spring in hidden grottoes seeping from mossy rocks where a goddess pours live water from a pitcher at clear streams in the meadow where rills murmur underground, your race and my race begin an amazement and quick passage. Naked, I exposed my face to the sun, steering with hardly a dip of the paddle. Oak woods, fields, a pine forest skimming by. Around every bend, the promise of the earth. Village smoke, sleepy herds, flights of martens over sandy bluffs. I entered your water slowly step by step, and the current in that silence took me by the knees until I surrendered, and it carried me, and I swam through the huge reflected sky of a triumphant noon. I was on your banks at the onset of midsummer night, when the full moon rolls out and lips touch in the rituals of kissing. I hear in myself, now as then, the lapping of water by the boathouse, and the whisper that calls me in for an embrace and for consolation. We go down with the bells ringing in all the sunken cities. Forgotten, we are greeted by the embassies of the dead, while your endless flowing carries us on and on, and neither is nor was, the moment only, eternal. So I hope you enjoyed this and uh, enjoy National Poetry Month and this lovely spring. Thank you.